Palestinians are happy about the decision of the International Court of Justice for calling on Israel to prevent genocide. However, no ceasefire was ordered, which was disappointed to many others. Our Telesul correspondent, Noor Harassan, with the details. Mixed feelings among Palestinians here on the ground. They are happy about the significant orders from the International Court, but at the same time they are disappointed because they wanted a ceasefire. They were thirsty for a ceasefire. This is what Palestinians here on the ground want. They want to see and feel some changes actually happening here on the ground, especially that we are talking big numbers. I mean, it has been 112 days of this Israeli operation on Gaza. We're talking about more than 26,000 Palestinians that were killed. 70% of them are women and children. We're talking about more than 1.5 million displaced Palestinians who, are, who were forced to evacuate their homes. So people want to go back to their homes. People want to see this uh, killing and people want to see more humanitarian aid entering into Gaza and they want to actually feel the humanitarian change here on the ground. So yes, it is mixed feeling, but uh, they are happy about uh, this promising beginning from the International Court. Talking about the latest on the ground, the Palestinian Health Ministry said that 183 Palestinians were killed in Gaza during the past 24 hours in various Israeli strikes and shitting uh, on Gaza from its north to its south. Most of these killings actually happened in the city of Khan Yunus. Nur Harazin, Gaza.